Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the GeoGuester Daily Challenge. Yesterday we had, well, it was a gold, um, but it was a tough game. So I actually ended first when I finished. I'm sure I didn't finish the day first or finish the daily first, but uh, when I finished, I was first, which felt great. All right, let's get into today. This feels like the Philippines, right? We're seeing what looks like Tagalog and some Spanish names, at least. Um... So Philippines, there's the flag of it, um, just to be sure. This says MCPS. I'm just wondering, maybe there's a little bit of information like precinct. This says police, 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 maybe. Um, maybe there's some information on where exactly we are. Yeah, that looks like it says Maza, Maza something, Mazagon, Mazadon. Um... Nothing that I can see right now. Maybe it's this. Um, no. Maradon, Maragon. For now, I'm going to place one in Manila. Okay, and then we're going to keep looking. We are going to keep looking and see if we have a an advertisement that maybe has um, a location on it. Katmon that says oh, Malabon City there you go Malabon is the name Malabon City uh, let's take a quick look for that if we don't find it we're gonna have to do a little bit more searching so now we zoom in a little bit more um, Malay Bay Marawi City just looking for Malabon, anywhere it might be. I'm not seeing it. So this is the concerning thing um, if it's too small I guess I'll leave it around here if it's too small and we can't find it um, that's really bad news so I'm gonna do some quick searching now eleven seconds Why do I feel like it's going to be down here? I'm placing down here. Oh, it was in the middle. Oh. Oh. What a devastating switch. Oh my god. You know what my thought process was? I saw a bunch of places that had the word city down here. And that was it. That was all I was thinking of. The, up here, not as many cities. More of just single names or... I don't know. But no, we were literally, apparently, right outside of Manila. We lost 2,000 points, and it's not looking good for us, especially now that we are in somewhere completely remote. Um, oh, man, that, that was just the worst. I deserve that. I should have just left it. I panicked at the end. Um, I don't know what this even feels like, this one, to be honest with you. It's like plenty grassy we have yellow in the middle white on the outside i don't know this could be south africa this could be brazil this could be plenty of places i have no idea so let's let's go find a sign or a car at least something i mean hold on so the car is driving on the right the license plate is short can't be brazil then right i believe they have long license plates only no deje piedra sobre el pavimento, that's uh, Spanish, so the sun seems to be maybe in the north-northwest-ish zone of things. So where would that mean? The car doesn't have, has a weird kind of shadow. 
taxi. I mean, this could be Columbia, weirdly. It's not yellow license plates, but like the northern area in Columbia comes to mind. Aside from this, I really just have no idea where this is going to be. Yeah, this is, it's not helpful. I mean, we could see if there's a cross. That sign is not crossed. So, again, where, Ecuador maybe? I mean, is there many flat parts in Ecuador? I don't think so, but it could be. I don't think it's Mexico based on sun location. Um, sun seems too, too, like, northy to be Mexico. Uh, it's a white car based on the reflection though. So that's going to be a Peru, Bolivia, or Chile thing. Black cars, Argentina, Uruguay. But then again, we can't really see the car that well. That says Rancho San something. I mean, this is just nothing. Nothing for miles. I don't even know what to think about this. Let's head east really quick. See if maybe there's something we missed. Because I don't currently even know where to put my guess, which is concerning. I'm going to put it probably right now in northern Colombia. But this could be Mexico. This could be, I mean, like I said, that sun isn't really identifying um, Mexico. I'm going to do some Mexico. Let's do it like up here. I don't know. I don't know. It was Mexico, but it was way too far away. We're in Yucatan. Uh, it didn't feel like Yucatan personally to me, based on what I've seen. Um, but again, you know, I'm no expert. So we lost too many points already, and we're out. Uh, okay, could be Scotland? Possibly. the. These are kind of fat ballers, and we have a stone wall, which is pretty indicative of that for me. Um, of Scotland. Let's see, do we have yellow at all in the back? Yes, we do. So, yeah, I think we're in Scotland. Um, Douglas? That says Douglas in six miles. So, that's good to our south. Uh, let's go to Scotland up here. Um, Douglas is... That's a place, right? I'm not going crazy. I'm, like, pretty sure that's a place. No, wait. Douglas is in Isle of Man. It's down here. And there's Ramsey. That says Douglas. Douglas is six miles. Ramsey, 61 miles. Ramsey's there. So Douglas, yeah. So we're, we're probably right around there. Perfect. That was a good round. Uh, yeah, it wasn't Scotland. It was Isle of Man. Got confused. All right. So now we're in a freaking jungle. Just in the middle of a jungle, which is just wonderful. Uh, it's kind of cool to look at. Don't get me wrong, it's very cool to look at, but one of maybe the worst rounds in recent memory here. I mean, we are literally just stuck in this little, around this tree, aren't we? Or maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Alright, so the first thing I think of when I think of GeoGuessr coverage in a jungly area, believe it or not, is Tasmania. Could be wrong though. Let's actually get out of here now that we can get out of here, and then I'll make a better guess. Um, this is interesting. Grupo Sur Acropolis. So that's all Spanish. We have what looks to be maybe Mayan or Aztec ruins. I don't really know who built the, these things. Uh, probably should know. It's a history thing, and I like history. I'm a history guy. Um, but I cannot tell you which pre-Columbian civilization built this. Um, if it even is one. I mean, I think it is, but I can't be sure. Um, let's get down and try to look for more clues, aka signs. Um, hoping that we can actually get down the stairs. Doesn't look like it. Please let me down the stairs, please, if I say please. I'm going to go this way, and then that way, and then that. Yes, we're down. Ooh, what did that say? Oh, that looks very like... 
Yeah. Ooh. Okay. That doesn't help. But this is cool. It's a cool round. It's definitely a cool round. Um. Right. The mines, right? This all we knew. This we knew. Uh, doesn't help though because it doesn't tell me country or region. Uh, but m mines were mostly Central America or Southern Mexico. We might just be in Yucatan again. Uh, they have plenty of mine ruins in Yucatan. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go right there. Um, sorry, not there. Not not even there. Not even there. Here. Let's go to Tulum. Why not? I've been there actually. Um, so that's cool. Maybe we're around here. Alright. Guatemala. Close enough. Uh, but yeah, that was a really tough one. That was, a uh, you know, today we're fighting against bronze. It's one of those days. Alright. Uh, all English. Short license plates. Short license plates. Um, Tampines. Uh, okay, that sounds funny. Avenue 5. Singapore then? Possibly? Left side driving? Mm-hmm. Okay. This could be. Uh-huh. Where else could this be? I think Singapore is the only option in my mind. There's a Singapore flag, so yeah. I mean, there's no other place this could be. Um, yeah, t tampine, t oh my god, no matter how you pronounce that word, it sounds funny, um, it sounds, yeah, um, so, T-A-M-P-I-N-E-S, town, is what we're looking for here, um, here it is, so, we are on Avenue... Three, four-ish area. How do you find that? I don't know. Avenue 7 here. Uh, you know what? Let's go back to where we started. I'm sure there's some information for us here. Yeah, Avenue 5 is perfect. Um, so that'll be down here. In here somewhere. Street 32... So the streets are the small ones, avenues are the big ones. I see seven, I see nine, where's five? Would help, there's four, so we gotta be near it, potentially. Uh, there's five. There is five, and we're just heading along to the south where we turn west and then link up with Street 91. This is something else. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to find this. Not that it's like super important that I do, but eh, sometimes it's good to try for the, for the plonk, for the exact pinpoint. Avenue 5 just... Ugh, it ends. Well, that's not ideal. We're probably in here somewhere. Definitely doesn't feel like a main road like this is making it out to look like. So I'm actually a little skeptical that Avenue 5 is correct. Um, but let's just go like in here. Yeah, we're a little further down. Is this going to be 91? Can't really tell. But hey, that uh, that was a little bit tough. Oh, there's 91 and there's... Oh, maybe it was 4 that we went? I don't know. Doesn't matter. 18,211 as our score. It was a really, really bad day. Really bad day, starting with the Philippines. Uh, me changing my guess, and that just kind of set the tone for the whole thing. Unfortunately, second round, it was Mexico, but it was just in Yucatan. Uh, and then I thought we were in Yucatan in round four. We weren't. Uh, just a mess. Just a mess. Good, good in two rounds, though. But that's never enough. But anyway, yeah, that's eighth place out of the first. I don't know. 48 people that played, not great. That's going to do it.
If you enjoyed, please leave a like down below, subscribe for daily GeoGuessr videos, leave a comment, let me know how you did on today's daily, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.